This is crazy. Oh! It's just a train. <laughs> What's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to October Fright Fest and today we play Befriended Curse and I do believe this came out towards the end of July and many of you have probably already seen it however if you haven't we're gonna step into the shoes of Jonathan a final year psychology student who has accepted what seems to be an enticing job offer for the summer break however things take a turn for the worse and upon arrival our car disappears leaving us trapped in a remote, desolate location far from civilization, and the one who extended the job offer is nowhere to be found, leaving us helpless and alone. The name is Mad Max, and I hope you enjoy the show. As a final year psychology student, you made the decision to start seeking your first professional job during the summer break. Coming across a job ad with the title, I'm having trouble communicating with my daughter. She hasn't been herself lately. As we live quite far from any major cities, I'd like to invite someone to spend the summer time with us and help us understand each other better. You embrace the challenge, and after a lengthy journey, you finally arrive at your destination. Dude, it's like we're driving in a freaking Camaro. We have no windshield. Flashlight, though. You would have thought someone would. It's a creepy ass gnome. You would have thought someone would have walked outside. Oh, it's a cat. It's not a dog. <laughs> um. We just knock. No. Hello? It's flipping quiet. Uh oh, hey. Hello? Sir? Ma'am? Hello? I'm here. Am I at the right place? Oh, it's this cat. Ah! Hello. Well, this sucks. Dude, if I drove all the way out here and I got to go back and get a freaking hotel room and come back in the morning. Oh, God. <gasps> Okay, yep, I got the creeps. We need to get out of here. What is that? Is that the daughter? I swear I just saw that little girl. Dude, wasn't there a... Hello? Okay, let's uh... Look, they've gotta be in the house. That little girl, man, she's messing with me. No wonder the dads can't talk to her, man. The little girl's mischievous. Oh. Hello? Anyone home? It's a really nice house, though. Reminds me of my grandma's house. I mean, the kitchen and everything. All the doors are open. Just gonna shut that. Sir? Ma'am? Little girl? 
I'm gonna call you ma'am. I'm gonna treat you with respect. What is going on? I'm gonna shut that too. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't want to just walk around your house. Well. Hello? Jeez, it's dark. Yeah, flashlight or something, man. I don't want to walk up those stairs. Everything's freaking dark. I'm gonna start messing with everything, guys. Y'all left me here by myself. Entry May 7th, 1983. Whispers are coming from the woods. We tried with Jacket to find their source, but without success. Why did we just take that? Okay. Well, we got another. Okay. Guys, I know y'all are here. I saw the little girl. What is this? Special edition. XXX9. Okay. Dude, what the hell is going on? What's this say? Hi. Thank you for taking on this role and assisting my daughter, Mia. I've stepped out briefly, but will return soon. But feel at ease and take the time to acquaint yourself with Mia. P.S. In one of the drawers in your upstairs bedroom, you'll find a document that requires your signature. It's a formality necessary for securing a partial refund to cover therapy expenses. Kindly sign it if you will. What in the hell? I've been walking around the house. Where's the little girl at? Okay, well. Upstairs in the bedroom. Mia? Mia? I hear you. Mia? It's okay. I'm a friend of your dad's. What the? Is that the cat? Can I pet you? Oh, I can pet you. Got a loud little motor. Oh God. There it is. All these rooms are super dark. Is this our room? It feels so old. It smells like grandma. I don't know what he was talking about. Ah. As the undersigned, I affirmed my willingness to aid Mia. Her challenges pose no difficulty to me. I'm equipped to manage them and assume responsibility in return for the service I am to receive compensation. Perhaps each region of the country has its own regulations? I'll sign. We do find that kind of strange and weird. But, okay, well, we signed our form. Shut that. There's nothing in here, right? Like nail polish. I wonder whose room we just took. <gasps> oh my god, what just happened? Mia! 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 I'm not gonna play this game. Your dad needs to get back. I can't go to sleep if you're in my closet. In my wardrobe. Okay. Well. So weird. This place is giving me the worst vibes. I don't really want to touch everything, but I'm super nosy. I gotta learn who this girl is. Oh god. Well, 
What in the hell? <gasps> what is that? Oh my god. There's pentagrams in the bathroom and a key. Like she wants to play a game or something. God. I'm like tired. I think I'm just freaking myself out. Mia. Ooh, there's another note. What is that? Darts. Entry 11, May 29, 1983. Someone was outside. They appear outside the window, but every time we go out with Jack, we can't find anyone. Okay. Well, the key doesn't work in her room. Mia, I need you to come out, girl. Huh. What if this key opens this up? Oh, it does. this thing I mean it's cute I think I want to go home uh it's quite cold tonight I better light the fireplace well, he did say... Cat's back down here. You know, he did say, uh... It's freaking pentagram. <gasps> oh my god, I'm so sorry. What is this? What is that? It's like a little girl outside the window or something. There's freaking like little pentagrams all over the place. I think that's what those are called, right? When it's just the star? Let's see if we can find some firewood. On the deck? God bless it every time! Step on it! Firewood. Looks like Aspen. <gasps> the hell was that? Okay. We gotta find a lighter. I don't like going outside. This place is flipping creepy. What? Lighter, lighter, lighter. Or maybe in the kitchen, but I don't know, maybe they'd have it by the fireplace. Yep, right there. Yes, okay. Um. Oh, that was quick. Alright. We got a fire. Mia! The hell turned that light out. What was that? Do I hear that? Ooh. Entry seven. What is happening to my daughter's skin? She's changing. She's complete. What? Oh no. It's probably all these freaking pentagrams you got all over the house. Okay. Well, we got a fire going. It's warming up. 
I think. It's, uh... Oh my god! Was that? That was upstairs. Wait. No call. <gasps> We just drank the milk <laughs> and a highway bar. All right, that, that was it, guys. We were just we're tired and we're hungry. <gasps> Strange look. Someone is by my car. Uh. Okay. Let's uh. Maybe the dad's back. Sir. <gasps> Someone's in my car. Get your ass out there! Oh no. Oh no. What are, what do we do? Oh, I just saw a little girl. Mia! Did your dad just take my car? What is that? Oh, there's a freaking moose! Oh my god. Is it not there anymore? No, he's standing right there. <gasps> there's no moose. Oh my god, nope. We gotta find a phone. Mia, this isn't funny. That freaking moose isn't funny. <gasps> what the F? There's another one. <gasps> okay, this isn't funny anymore, Mia. Mia? What the hell's going on? What the hell's going on? Oh my god. Oh my god, what the hell was that? Oh no. Okay. Alright, we, we just gotta find a... Just gotta find a phone. What is this? Uh, mother, daughter. Oh... Cat, what are you doing? What are you doing? I don't want to open that door. <gasps> what the absolute F was that? Nope. The freaking moose is still staring. <gasps> well, Alright, we're done. We gotta find a phone. We gotta find a phone. <gasps> what is this? Entry 3. Recently, we learned a lot of what happened in this area in the Middle Ages. We believe that it's somehow connected to what's happening to Mia. We're still doing more research. What the hell happened here? X, 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 1. Okay, hold up. There was another X upstairs, right? It was X, X. Oh my god, there's freaking moose everywhere. <gasps> ah! God bless it, man. Okay, there's... There's gotta be a phone. There's gotta be something somewhere, right? Phone, phone, phone. I mean, he contacted me somehow. <gasps> ah! What is that? Oh my god, I'm done. We gotta get out here. Out of here. <gasps> what is that? Ah! What is that? Ah! We, we, need, we need to leave. We need to get out of here. Oh my god, dude. This isn't funny anymore. This isn't funny. Mia, there's something wrong. If this is you, please just tell me. Mia. Ah. 
<gasps> oh my god. Oh my word. Mia? What the hell is that? God bless it. This isn't funny anymore, Mia. Oh no. <gasps> ah! <gasps> oh! Alright, we, we just gotta get it. I'm done. This family's jacked up. XX5X. Okay, X519. Something's, something's wrong. We're done. What does this say? Hi, my name is Mia. Although my mom calls me Cursed Mia ever since it happened, I'm glad you got rid of the car and decided to stay with me. I'm so happy that you're here. P.S. This is not my cat. <gasps> oh no. Oh no, 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 no. This was all a trick. Can I pet you? Oh god, this is all a trick. We're not supposed to be here. I want to go home. I want to go home. I want to go home. Mia? What? Huh! <gasps> Mia. This isn't funny anymore. Huh? Huh! Oh my god. What is going on? Ah! <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Mia. Dude, wouldn't that be crazy? <gasps> she's, <laughs> she's back upstairs. Mia. What is that? Okay. Oh no, I forgot what they are. Okay. Oh my god, I'm gonna forget what they are. Please don't do it. This isn't fun anymore. Okay. It's 4X519. Mia. Oh no. This is nuts. What is this? The dresser. That's not the dresser. Oh, <gasps> my, uh... My cursor keeps trying to move to places. Ah! I don't know if I'm supposed to... What is this? Oh my god, the... History of witch hunts dates back to ancient times. The earliest records of bans on magical practices and penalties for witchcraft can be traced to antiquity. However, it wasn't until the mid 15th century that a flourishing period of witch hunting practices emerged. This was when Pope Nicholas V, in a letter to Hugues de Lubino, I think that's how you say that, um, Lublin, I, I don't know. The Inquisitor for France granted the Inquisition the authority to deal with all cases of magical practices and witchcraft, even those not overtly associated with heresy. The prevailing document prior to this was the much milder Canon Episcopi, written in 906. Oh boy. We're dealing with witches. Straight up witchcraft. We already knew that with the freaking stars and the things on the wall, but that just confirmed it. Mia, this isn't funny anymore. <gasps> oh my god, dude, why are you putting the lights out? I don't want to go outside. Okay. Okay. That should address her. We gotta find a dresser. That's 
bit. What is that? Oh my, oh, there's a door. This isn't good. That's not good. Mess with this crap. The husband and wife. Entry 43. My husband is gone. He sacrificed himself. My beloved Jacquette. Oh god. What is this? Mia is no longer entirely human. Her body looks as if it was burned. She says it hurts every day, but she's alive. Oh no. Do we do this? Oh! <gasps> Oh, that means we gotta find stuff. Oh my god. We gotta get out of this house. We gotta get out of this house. I don't know where to go. I don't want to go outside. Yeah. I don't even remember what those are. Oh, oh god! <laughs> Crap. Oh no, turn the light back on. <gasps> what was that? I gotta find that dresser. We gotta find that dresser. None of these look like it. <gasps> what was that? I don't like that thing. What is this? Armchair? Oh! <gasps> Armchair. I had to hide this message so the old lady from the forest wouldn't find it. Be careful with her. She's the reason all the bad things happened. My mom says because of that witch, I am the way I am. And that because of her. Dad. <gasps> oh, she opened a door. Oh, no. We are not looking for Mia outside. Holy crap. That took me forever. I thought I, I, thought I looked at that armchair. There's a freaking moose. Oh, there's so many mooses. Mooses are mean, don't hurt me. <gasps> oh god. Mia. So she wants us to find her. Oh god. <gasps> oh god, nope. 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 Oh, there's freaking moose. I don't know. Can you? Oh, I can't go that way. <gasps> oh no. Mr. Moose, please. I think I have to go. This way. Oh God! <gasps> God. Mia. I don't know where to go. I'll go back up here on the, uh, oh, oh, Mr. Moose. Oh, I see a path. This isn't good. This isn't good. <gasps> oh. oh, 
Oh! <gasps> you get your ass out of here! Oh my god! <gasps> Hide in the house! Hide in the house! Where did it go? Where do I hide? <gasps> I need to lock the main and garden doors quickly. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. She's gonna be freaking stared at me through one of these windows. Where'd Mia go? I can't, I can't tell if she's my friend or not. Okay. Okay. Just go upstairs. Okay. Maybe in here now? Still no. I still have not found that dresser. I mean, <gasps> oh God. Oh my God, you second. <gasps> God. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Shut it. Lights back on. <laughs> Just pick it up. Just pick it up. Turn the light back on. Oh, oh my god. I don't, I don't want to play anymore. Oh, I don't want to play anymore. Oh no. God. Mia, I need your help. She's crazy. Oh, God. That's, that's still not open. Maybe we need to go put this doll downstairs? <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I see the stupid cat. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh. Okay. I'm gonna pet you every time. Yep. You make me feel better. Okay. Downstairs. Downstairs. Uh, let's just go down here. Oh, come on. Don't do it. What is that? Okay. Uh, I don't know if we're supposed to do that or not. Oh my god. Everything hurts. Everything hurts. <laughs> I got this. I got this. Ah! Oh. oh no. What do I do? I can't see. Oh God. Guys, I can't see. Oh. Oh, we're lighting candles. Okay. Lighting candles. That's just gonna make everything so much better. <gasps> oh man. 
what time is it? It's freaking four. Oh god, it's Okay. I feel like I'm I'm missing something. I don't have a light. So I'm guessing we go upstairs now. Okay, so do we do we go upstairs? Throughout the Middle Ages, many innocent individuals were burnt at the stake. However, legend has it that in 1492, a young woman began screaming in an unknown language and casting curses while being burned. Suddenly, everyone gathered around started hearing terrifying whispers. The woman, partially burned, emerged from the blazing pyre, and everyone fled. According to the legend, in the following weeks, the residents were afflicted by a strange epidemic. They began to go insane, and their skin turned ashen as if they had been burned. Not much else is known because the Inquisition deemed eyewitnesses of the event, who claimed that the witch had cursed them as heretics and sentenced them accordingly. Oh my god, we are dealing with some crazy stuff. Okay. Do I go upstairs? Light this one. There's candles everywhere. Hey. Hey. In the bathroom. Oh, I don't want to go in there. <sighs> oh, God. I'm hurting. I'm hurting, guys. I'm hurting. Oh, oh God! <gasps> I'm not gonna remember that freaking number. Oh, there's the other one. Okay. I wanna light this candle too, though. Ah! Okay. All right, we're gonna we're gonna look at these one more time because I feel like I'm gonna need these numbers, X X five X, okay. Can't go in there yet. We have the other little thing. Oh, I'm hurting. All right, four X. Oh my God, I can't, I'm so stressed, guys. Four X five. We got four X five. Four X five. I don't remember where the other ones even are. Four X. Oh my God. Four X five one. And there's a nine. Four X five one nine. Four X five one nine. Four X five one nine. Let's go in the basement. Oh. Put a candle there. 4X519. Oh, I don't want to do it. Oh. <gasps> I'm not. Nope. I'm not turning around. Oh. I even looked at those pictures. Oh no. I'm guessing that might go to that room upstairs. I'm gonna look at these pictures real quick, the ones I can remember where they're at. Okay. 
Let's just go to this room. Oh, I don't want to go in here. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no, you stop it right now. Oh my god. <gasps> Are they all lit? Are they all lit? I don't even know. Oh, we're gonna hear. Entry 33, every time Mia steps a few feet away from the house, she loses consciousness. We don't take her anywhere because we fear she'll die. Oh my god, so she, maybe she, again, I think she's helping us now. As you can see, my mom is trying everything just to help me and lift the curse. She's even spoken with spirits, at least that's what she believes. Although it's my dad who sacrificed the most. I miss him. Oh my god, no, this got really sad. Oh no. What do we do? <gasps> what is this? We just moved a mirror. We just moved a mirror. Oh, God. Oh, no. Holy crap. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Oh, look, here's the lock. Okay. We're going to have to, we're going to have to wing it. 4X. Five, one, nine. Okay, we're gonna assume it's not any of these numbers, so let's go two, three. Oh, four. <gasps> oh my god, guys. What is this? Oh, there is hope. The curse can be lifted. Okay, don't do it. I said don't do it. Oh, I'm freaking stressed. Oh my god. No, 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 no. You stop it right now, ma'am. You stop it right now. You leave this little girl and her family alone? Oh. Oh no. N E W U S H O N E W U S H O on E one I don't know what that's saying. One Is that saying one wish? It is, it's saying one wish. Okay. One wish, I got I get you. I don't know what to do now though. One wish. One wish. I wish for this freaking curse to be gone. Save this little girl. Okay, what do we do? Ah! Where are you at? I want to help you. One wish. <gasps> hey, I see you. I see you. I want to help. I want to help. Just don't eat my face. But I don't know where you went. 
you go downstairs? Oh! <gasps> I freaking see her. She's right there. I'm not going in there. Okay. Let's go down in the basement. Oh, there you go. God, you scared me. I want to help you. Oh, I see you. Just don't eat me, little girl. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to look at you that way. I really do want to help you. Mom said I should ask you about this in a poem, so I wrote one. I see your fervent wish to flee. Alas, I comprehend yet grieve. One wish fulfill, and soon you'll see. All shall unravel clear. Believe. Gather crimson blooms. Trail the woods to where my father's grave abides. Lay flowers there, as kindness should. My curse forbids, my soul abides. Will you fulfill this one wish of mine? Will you take flowers to my dad's grave? Yes. Will it help you? <gasps> Find red flowers. Take them to the girl's father's graves. Red flowers. I'll help you. Just stop. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to make fun of you. But how am I supposed to find red flowers? I can't see anything. Oh, oh ma'am. Oh, I see your freaking face. What is that? Oh, it's a flashlight. Oh. This should have given me this a long time ago. Oh, there's red flowers. I see them. Find red flowers. Is it just the one? Oh, God. Now her father's grave. Where's her father? I bet it's this way, isn't it? Oh, my God, dude. Those coyotes sound like they're having sex. Huh. Oh no. Oh no. Where? Am I walking on his grave? Ah. God, stop. I, I guess I'm on the trail. I don't know, guys. This is crazy. Oh! It's just a tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate this. I don't know if I'm going the right way. Oh, God. I'm just going to try to keep... Oh, there, there it is. I think... I was just trying to keep the trees on both my right and my left. Can we run? I'm so done. Oh god, I'm so done. Please let this be it. Please let this be it. <gasps> okay. Tidy up the grave. To lift the curse from one soul, two must make a pledge. One giving life, the other... The curse they'll hedge. Oh! No! As dawn breaks and shadows flee, the curse transfer set both souls free. It's gonna make me sacrifice myself. I already know it. Shysta. Place flowers in the vases on the grave. I don't feel. Oh, 
god. <gasps> my skin, I feel like it's burning. Oh my god, no, we're doing it. We're so. <gasps> from one soul two must make a pledge one giving life the other the curse they'll hedge a written vow to aid with desire fulfilled one minute spent a night in the curse bound house chilled as dawn breaks and shadows flee the curse transfers set both souls free a soul given a soul embraced in the dance of fate curses intertwined like night and day intertwined like fate the witch bears witness as time flows like verse when the magic ritual fulfills and the curse dissipates in the hand's gentle traverse. Dude. Oh no. I agreed to lift the curse only if I receive two souls in exchange for one. For the first, I demand a sacrifice of life. Mia's father committed suicide. I accepted this sacrifice. However, the second person must take on the curse. There's a written contract on the table which you signed yourself. You sealed it by spending the night in the same house as the cursed person and fulfilling one of their wishes. You slut. As the undersigned, I affirm my willingness to aid Mia. Her challenges pose no difficulty to me. I am equipped to manage them and assume responsibility in return for this service. I am to receive compensation. Oh, look at her freaking smirk! I accept this sacrifice. From now on, your soul is mine. You become cursed. You will never die, but your body will slowly turn into ashes and dust. You will experience slowly throughout eternity what I experienced when I was burned at the stake as a young witch in 1492. Oh! <gasps> Like you probably guessed, I agreed to lift Mia's curse and Mia returned to being a normal girl. Her mom just left with her. Congratulations on your courage and sacrifice, young man. <gasps> yeah, no problem. Oh God. What a crappy ending. Well, didn't that escalate quickly? I kind of feel good. I saved a mom and her daughter, but I don't know. Let me know, what would you do? Would you take on the curse or would you leave? Nevertheless, again, thank you for watching. Thank you for your love and support. It is much appreciated and this channel only exists because of guys and gals like yourself. And if you want to support more, consider smashing that like button, leaving a small comment, not to mention we have a free Discord channel. You can hop in, you can chat with each other, you can chat with me. Anyways, guys, gals, again, thank you for your love and support. But now it's that time. Stay frosty, stay mad, and I'll see you all in the next one.